when we migrated to Dynamics CE, our users were confused about the difference between leads and contacts, what to create when. So we used Visual SV to put these inline help icons right next to a contact. They hover over it, they know exactly what it is. Same thing with leads, hover over the inline help icon and they can see exactly when they would create a lead as opposed to a contact. We even put a link to a short video. So when users click on that, a video appears telling them about leads versus contacts, all in context of their environment. Now I'm gonna show you exactly how this was configured. Visual SP shows up as my company icon on the top right. I click on that and because I have editor rights here, I will go ahead and search for lead. When I find that lead, which is exactly the same as the lead help icon there, I'm going to edit. And within here, I'll go into the section that's for walkthrough builder. And I'm gonna check on my content here. This is where exactly the content that shows up for the user. Now back in the help item tab, if I go halfway to the bottom, there's a section to enable inline help. This is how I place the inline help icon on the page by selecting an element on the page and moving around the icon to be exactly where I want it to be for my users. I'll go ahead and replace this on the top right of the leads word. And that's it. Now if I click on preview, this is where it is. That's how easy it is to place inline help icons in various places in Dynamics CE to guide my users using Visual SP. To learn about how Visual SP can help your organization, go to visualsp.com and schedule a private demo. Talk to you soon.